Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Joshua McDonald and today we're going to be taking a look at the 2024 GMC Sierra AT4X. Now before we get started, make sure you guys like this video, subscribe down below for more content. Let's get right into it. So we'll start off with the key. You have the lock, unlock, remote start, tailgate, and panic button features. Up front, you can see we have the AEV front bumper. LED headlights, nice Vader Chrome GMC grill. You have the AT4X wheels and tires, as well as the off road suspension, skid plates underneath. This has the 6.2 liter V8, AT4X badges on the sides. Got this big step in the back bumper to get up. Have all your towing hookups down below for your hitch, all your lights, and this is to get your spare tire. This does have the multi-pro tailgate, so the top button releases the top portion, which you can use as a little table, or you also have the load stop feature cool thing about this one is it has the kicker audio system we'll take a look at that here in a minute let's go ahead and lower it all the way down with this button so there's that kicker stereo system it does have bluetooth so you can just hook up your phone and play some music and if you want to get up into the bed, you have this handle right here that you can pull up and use to pull yourself up into the bed. Also back here, we have our spray in bed liner with the AT4X logo. Three prong outlet. You have all your lights, tie downs, everything like that in the bed. Go ahead and close everything up. Easy fill gas cap. Since it is a 6.2, it only takes 93. And we'll take a look at the back seat. So for the AT4X, you have the special red stitching, white stitching with white accents, as well as the AT4X little design here. Look at that, guys. Beautiful interior. Storage behind the seats. You have your cup holders in the middle. Really nice floor mats with the AT4X. Also lift up the seats. So you have a little bit of storage under there with all your tools you need to get the spare tire. We have a heated second row with the air vents and phone plug-ins. Let's go ahead and hop in, start her up. So as soon as you hop in, you can see the AT4X. Got this cool little cinematic movie that plays for you. We'll put our foot on the brake, hit this button, and it starts right up. So up here we have the main screen that shows you your miles per hour, RPM, as well as your fuel range, you have a bunch of little different tabs on here where you can see your tire pressure, oil life, brake pad life, everything you need to know about the vehicle. We also have a music tab, navigation, phone, and a settings tab. So you can change the left side info, right side info. All of this is fully customizable. On the steering wheel, we navigate that screen by using these. Left, right, up, down. Hands-free Bluetooth and calling. We do have our shift paddles behind the wheel. So this will upshift, this will downshift. We have a heated steering wheel. We have our forward collision gap adjust. So you have one car, two car, and three car lengths. 
cruise control controls right here. We have an electronic parking brake. All of our four wheel drive controls are just buttons. We also do have our different drive modes. So you can change that by pulling to the left or right. So we have normal, sport, off-road, and terrain mode. We have all of our light controls down here, as well as our heads-up display controls. You can move it up or down, change the info, or turn up or down the brightness. You can see the heads-up display located right there in the window, so while you're driving, it gives you a nice view of all the information you need. Again, we have our special AT4X trim built into the door here with the Bose audio system. This is really nice, like stainless steel material. Nice deep center console. We have a three prong outlet, couple hookups for our phones and a wireless charging pad. We have our trailer brake adjuster right here where you can adjust the gain. And we have the electronic precision shifter. So on the left side, we have a button that you hold down. You pull back for drive, pull back again for L mode, push all the way up for reverse, and then just a little bit up for neutral. If you want to put it on park, you just push this P. We have a couple more phone hookups right here with a ton of storage and cup holders and stuff like that. We have all these buttons in the middle. So this is the start button like I showed you. We have cooled seats, heated seats on the driver and passenger side, dual zone climate controls. You can turn the fan speed down or up. And we also have our lane keep assist, parking sensors, automatic stop start. This opens up the tailgate in the back. We have our hazards, traction control, hill descent, and our rear and front lockers. So we have a humongous touchscreen here. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. So on the touch screen, we have our home button, either the physical button or on the screen, we have an audio tab, navigation, phones, and the trailering app. So in the audio, we have AM, FM, Sirius XM radio. We also do have built-in Google Maps. We have all of our cameras. It does have the surround view where you can see in front of you, you can see behind you, you can see in the bed, you can see the front left tire, front back, all that good stuff, and we have a hitch view. Makes it super easy to hook a trailer up. We also do have our trailering app where you can set up different trailer profiles, our climate controls, Wi-Fi hotspot settings, all these apps right here on the screen. So really nice interface. Um, it is a really big screen. I believe it's 11.3 inches diagonally. So gives you a lot of space there to work with. We also do have the rear view camera mirror that you can deactivate by pulling down on it or you can pull up. You do have different settings for brightness. You can zoom in or out. You can move it up or down to your liking. On the AT4X, we also do have this special suede headliner with the leather, leather wrapped handles. Really nice touch there. We also do have our OnStar buttons. We can open up the rear window with that button and we have all of our sunroof controls so we can open that up gives you that nice open air feel we can close it back and we also do have the tilt so you can just tilt it up like that you can manually close it or open it just like that and another cool feature is we have not one, but two glove boxes. So you have a glove bo box up top and one down below for plenty of storage space. These are the seats. So they had the AT4X stitching as well as in the door. Gives it a really nice premium feel. And we also have a couple cup holders for the back seat right there. So that's pretty much it for the inside guys. We'll hop out and take a look at the outside one last time.
it, make sure you guys comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of the AT4X. I'll go ahead and show you the window sticker as well. So 2024 GMC Sierra 1500 AT4X. This is Onyx black with the Obsidian Rush interior. 6.2 liter V8 with a 10 speed automatic transmission. Standard vehicle price is 79.2 for the AT4X. With all the options and everything, this specific one is 83980. So there's the whole window sticker. But appreciate you guys watching. I'll see you next time. Have a good one.